What's up people, in this video I'll be showing you the most efficient farming methods in Black Myth Wukong as time is will as they say. We'll be running the farm from Towers of Karma Chapter 3 today with the following loadout to boost our capabilities. Starting with the armour, we got the Skull of Turtle Treasure Helm to increase chance at gain of materials upon enemy defeat, followed up with the Pilgrim's Garb set to increase speed to and from the farm. Next up, all three Curios equipped are vital, starting with the Golden Carp to increase enemy item drop rate, the Celestial Registry Tablet to increase experience gained, and the Gold Flora Hairpin to increase will gained. This is purchased from the Man in Stone shopkeeper from Fright Cliff, Chapter 2, as shown now. I only sell rare fine wares. Why would be selling it to no one if it wasn't? Uh, you got yourself a right fine bargain. The final tip is to tether the incense trail talisman to your quick access bar to easily reset back to the shrine. You can simply run back, but using the talisman gives you a 4-5 to five seconds breathing space before starting the next climb. As you can see now, this farm itself is a singular enemy and takes less than 10-12 to 12 seconds to run to completion. 30 minutes in this spot, I managed to farm 2 Beast Buddha Curios, 5 Mine Cores and 3 Sparks to upgrade my skill tree attributes. Obviously farming is not essential in Black Myth Wukong, but if you're on the Platinum Trophy grind or simply a completionist, it may be necessary. Let me know in the comments if this has helped you in any way, or if you've got any additional farming tips for the community. That'll be all from me, cue the montage, until the next one, peace.